The University of Arkansas and vendors that sell items using the word Omahogs now have to pay a royalty to the NCAA. KNWA's Lauren Krakow at the stadium shop on Razorback to show us how this fee is not sitting well with store owners. Items that say Omahogs like this shirt bought or sold will now see an additional 6% royalty fee attached to them. In other words, the same items you bought this year with the word Omahogs on them will cost you more next year. This phrase is owned and trademarked by the University of Arkansas. Stadium shop on Razorback owner Robert Mann says it's pretty much the U of A baseball team's nickname. He says what the NCAA is trying to do is take the idea of Omahogs and turn it into a new thing at the College World Series. A thing where other schools like Texas Longhorns would be Omahorns. Mann says this is a way for the NCAA to make a money grab and wants people to know this will not affect Arkansas or store owners like himself. But this will affect the fans. They're the only ones that are going to be suffering because of this. Because guess what? The price of stuff goes up. You tack on an extra 6% on this, the price of everything with Omahogs on it goes up. Mann says he is a lifelong Razorback fan and this news really frustrates him because prices are going up for people who don't deserve it. He says he wants to make clear that he has no issues with licensing and gets why it exists. And he says he does not think it is the fault of the leadership at the University of Arkansas either and that this is strictly an NCAA issue. I reached out to the University of Arkansas for a comment, but no one was available. In Fayetteville, Lauren Craycock, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.